Hello folks, Junkie Rock 13 here. Everything vaping related is Junkie Rock 13. My real name is Ross Sanders, and today I'm bringing you a device sent to me for purposes of review. It is called the Calibre Nano Electronic Cigarette Kit Starter Kit. Um, comes with a PCC, a little charging station right here, with a couple batteries and some pre-filled cartridges. I'm going to take a close look at it, see what I think about it, and talk about the Calibre Nano. Let's get right to it. Okay, so here we go. This is the unboxing and close-up of ePuffer's Calibre Nano. Um, it comes in a cardboard box, a display box. Nice little box with magnets holding down one end. Okay, so when you open it up, you'll notice that it looks like a pack of cigarettes very similar size to a pack of cigarettes and this is the PCC okay place that off to the side and show you what else is in the box a little foam here is a user guide okay and this will tell you everything that is in the kit and how to charge your battery. Nice little user manual. A little quality control checker inspection. And what we have is a USB charging wire. This will connect right into the bottom of your PCC. Okay, it's not a mini or a micro, it's one of them round ones there. Okay, and then we have a wall outlet for your USB wire. Okay, and it is one of them ones that flip down in your device. charged into the wall just like so. This is how I've been using this charger directly into the wall. Okay, so let me just put this back in there and talk about the PCC and the device itself. All right, so like I said, here is your PCC. Now it has a kind of like a silky rubbery touch to it but it is not rubbery okay there's a little push button right there that will open up your flip top oh and i took out the device and i never put it back in well <laughs> here is the device that will be over in that section and you'll notice that there are one, two, three, four, five, six different places for the uh, PCC to hold different spots, different holders for different units. Over on the far left will be a complete electronic cigarette device. Now, when it arrived, it had this one installed in it which I would like to show you what it says right there it says storage cartridge come on show it Well, it's storage cartridge and there is no nicotine or no e-liquid in this one it's basically a dummy cartridge 
So I'll just toss that off to the side. But I took one of the other cartridges that were there and installed it on my electronic cigarette. Okay. So this one is fully assembled. I'll just place that back into there. And here is another battery flipped upside down with the ash end sitting out. When you place it on this holder or section right there, that is the section that will actually charge your batteries. So this one is completely charged, so it is turned off. Let me see if this one is not completely charged and see if it will charge. Oh, that one is completely charged also. When it is charging, the light will stay lit like that and it will turn off when completely charged. Because this one is completely charged, I will leap off of this one. And then you will get a total of four filled cartridges. Here are two brand new ones with the rubber little coating tops on there on the threading and little rubber stoppers on the top of them. So over at ePuffer you can buy these empty or with your favorite e-liquid. So I'm just going to toss that one in there and throw this little storage dummy device over on that end. All right, so let's talk about this PCC. It is basic the size of maybe a pack of cigarettes. Um, I have not totally ran out of charge on this. You'll notice that that device is flashing, so it is completely charged now. Okay, so I don't have the exact um, size of the battery that is inside of the PCC or on the um, electronic cigarette, but I will tell you on how long it has been lasting me. The cigarettes themselves have been lasting me approximately between an hour and an hour and a half of straight vaping. Um, I can get probably two hours out of them if I'm not vaping really hard. But it is nice that there is a PCC right here that I can just take this off and just charge them when they are weak on juice. Um, the charger has been lasting me about 10 to 15 charges but that's not an accurate reading because they weren't fully discharged batteries or um, so I cannot give you an accurate reading on how long the PCC lasts uh, that is as close to the reading I can tell you but so I don't knock anything off the table this is the close-up of the Calibre Nano from ePuffer let's see how it vapes and see what I think about it okay so there you go there's the close-up of the Calibre ePuffer Nano um, I want to first off say that usually Pre-filled cartridges are not anything that I tend to buy um, because this was sent to me for purposes of review. I keep an open and honest opinion on the juice and the device. I normally do not do juice reviews, 
but because this has pre-filled cartridges, I will talk a little bit about them. First off, let me say that the battery life on the electronic cigarette itself um, does not last that long. Um, about an hour if you're vaping the way I vape. If you're just using it like a cigarette, going out, have a cigarette for like 10 minutes, come back in or whatever, um, you could probably get longer. But I'm usually, after I vape on it for a little while, I usually throw it into the charger and charge it. It really normally does go dead. So the PCC is an awesome device to have included in your kit. These uh, pre-filled cartridges, I'm not a big fan of. Um, the juice level is zero or point six milligrams. Okay, of nicotine. Uh, that being said, I don't know exactly how much nicotine is in them. Uh, let me show you how it vapes. <clears throat> Not much vapor on these. You actually have to work at it. If you were just going to take a normal drag like you would do off of a cigarette, you're not going to get a lot of vapor. So you will need to actually puff it, build it up, and then uh, inhale it. <sighs> it's not performing well. Um, I don't know if it has to do with the pre-filled cartridges, um, but I actually let one run dry, vaped it all the way dry, and then took a little bit of my juice and put it in there, and it was still performing the same way. Now this is a regular standard uh, tobacco blend, but in my opinion, I am not really digging this device. Um, I do, however, like the idea of the personal charger. This is a great idea to include with kits with devices like this. It does work great um, in charging your devices. Actually, let me just, this other battery is fully charged. Let me put this other cartridge on it show you that this one is actually performing the same way. Not a lot of vapor. Um, you're not going to be getting the same amount as if you were smoking a regular cigarette. The flavor is not bad. Typical tobacco blend. The flavor is not that bad. I am actually think the flavor is pretty good but it's just not performing the way that I have had other small cigarette looking devices perform. That was a little bit better, but you have to build it up like puff it in order to uh, get decent vapor. wasn't that bad. You really do have to work at it though. It's getting better as I keep on going. Still not satisfying for me, my opinion. Um, that's what I have on the e-puffer Calibre Nano. Uh, I will leave a link in the description to check these out. But that's all I have. Be kind to one another and keep on vaping, everybody.
Take care.